thank you all for coming. Uh, my name's Derek Langley. I'm the Regional Vice President for the British Chamber of Commerce here in sunny Andalusia. Um, just spoke, thought I'd say a few minutes about what the Chamber does here. Then I'll introduce our sponsor today, Peris de Varga. And then after Lola has finished, I will ask all of you to stand up and talk about yourselves. And then we're going to get into some serious networking. Um, the British Chamber in Spain has been here for just over 100 years. It's the part of the largest professional business networking organization, probably one of the largest in the world. Um, in every country in the world, in every major city, you'll find a British Chamber of Commerce office or associate office. So it's this network which facilitates people doing business. <clears throat> the Chamber itself has its roots in Barcelona, Catalonia. Uh, the head office is still there. We have a regional office in Spain in Madrid and we have another office here in Nueva Andalusia. The brand of the Chamber is strong. Um, in Spain we're very closely associated with the British Embassy in Madrid, uh, the British Consulate in Malaga and also the UK Trade and Investment Office uh, in Madrid where we basically represent them in Andalusia. So it's these three agencies which we work very, very closely with. We're very, very different from any other networking organizations here. A, we're long established, B, we have credibility, and C, we have this sort of quasi-government backing. All of these things put together help people to do business. Business is about networking, business is about talking to people, selling yourself to people. Um, the membership of the chamber has the largest Spanish companies in it, and the smaller ones. Uh, each region is different. Madrid obviously has the corporate companies. Uh, Barcelona has SMEs and it's a bit larger. And on the Costa here we have small to medium companies. What I'd like to do now is pass you over to Lola Corral. Um, Lola is a member of the Lo regional committee here, as is Christina Axford from Spectrum FM, as is where are you? Paul Ellis from Currencies Direct, etc. So we all work hard down here to work with you to help promote the business, okay? So I'll pass over to Lola. Thank you, Lola. And to those of the, you who do not know me, I'm Lola Corral from Pérez de Vargas Abogados. Uh, I'm in charge of the International uh, Investment Department. Uh, Pérez de Vargas uh, has been in business uh, since 1973, 42 years down the line now, specializing in property law, urbanistic law, banking law, and tax. That is our speciality. We have always been dealing with corporate clients and have now expanded into the retail business, to put it in a banking uh, terminology. We want to reach out to the end client, to the end buyer, out of a demand that we've received from our, from our corporate clients. Uh, we have uh, two offices, one in Estepona, one in Marbella. We have 15 lawyers speaking English, French, Spanish, some German and Russian. We have a Russian lawyer. Uh, she will be coming in the next uh, couple of minutes. We attend the client from the very beginning until the very end, as every lawyer does in Marbella. Um, so I'm not going to actually go into detail uh, on that. For us, it's very important. Um, we want to put special emphasis on the fact that urbanistic due diligence and technical due diligence on any investment or any purchase that you carry out in Spain is done before you actually purchase. That is what we specialize in. We will come to you in your own country, we will give you the advice, we will bring you over, we will show you around, we will tell you whether it's worth investing or not, we will do a tax report, we will issue a survey, and we will give you all the information prior to you making your decision on the purchase. Once again, it's important to be able to speak to the client in their own language. Uh, we are now looking for a Swedish uh, or Norwegian lawyer because uh, we have to have one and these clients uh, insist on being um, assisted in, in, in their own language so they have every right to do that. I don't speak Norwegian, I speak everything else, but I don't speak Norwegian. Uh, so basically, uh, there's not much more to say. Pere de Vargas eh, Marbella is the international office Estepona is where we do litigation for any client that may need litigation. Uh, most of our clients are expats, 99% of my clients are expats in my department. And we help them not only to establish themselves to purchase, but also to take care of any other issue that may come about. They get divorced, they remarry, 
Uh, they want to send their children to school. They want to do further investments. They want to open a business, startup, compliance, data protection, whatever uh, they may need, we, we can help them with. We don't do publicity. We're not very good at doing publicity. Our director, Mr. Ignacio Pérez de Vargas, is adverse to publicity. We prefer. That's why we are very happy to be members of the British Chamber. And we prefer to talk to you on a one-to-one -one basis, help you, uh, free consultations, of course, if you come to us for the first time, and help you with whatever issue you or your clients may have. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much.